Hi, I'm James. I'm your senior market analyst here at Easy Forex. Today, I'm giving you a heads up on a story that just won't go away. And that story is, of course, about Greece. Now, the story so far. As you might remember, last week, we did say that on the 11th of February, there was an emergency meeting between the Eurozone and Greece to try and sort out Greece's current debt bailout program. There was a no deal. Then on the 16th, Greece actually said no to new proposals to extend their debt, saying the conditions of the new deal was absurd. Now, we are approaching a deadline of 28th of February. This is when Greece's current debt bailout program actually expires. However, the Eurozone has said to Greece, you have until this Friday to accept a, ba a bailout extension. Now, what are the potential scenarios? Uh, what are the outcomes of this current event going on around us? Well, scenario one, we could see a Greek exit. Now, comment banks and analysts actually believe if this was to happen, you could see the euro dollar fall as low as 107, levels not seen since 2003. Scenario two, you can see capital restrictions put on to Greece, where the ECB would decrease liquidity to Greek banks. Barclays analysts say if this actually could happen, they could see the euro dollar fall as low as 1.1098. Scenario number three, we make a deal at the very last moment. What happens? Goldman Sachs analysts believe if this actually does occur, you could see a relief rally in the euro dollar all the way up to 1.160. So how about the rumours? Plenty of rumours at the moment. Rumours, of course, going around that Greece will indeed say yes to an extension. If they don't and they default, there's rumours that Russia or the United States could actually jump in and bail out Greece. Plus, there's a lot of concern and rumours going on about how the eurozone feels about this current situation. They're scared that if Greece does indeed exit, you could see pressure on the likes of countries from Spain and Italy doing the same. So what to watch on this event? Of course, we have the euro dollar, but I would also suggest keep a close eye on the euro pound, trading at levels not seen since 2008, and the euro yen, always a potential good mover, especially when recently we have a Bank of Japan representative saying that any further stimulus in Japan will be counterproductive. But this is not trading advice or a recommendation. I'm simply giving you a heads up. I'm James, a senior market analyst here at Easy Forex. You trade safe.